trailer that they dropped, we finally seen what was going on here. So before Kane pulled the gun on this guy, Kane was fighting this guy. Man, nigga, fuck Kane, nigga. I got to put that on there. So the first time we see Kane in the original, like the first teaser, he's pulling the gun on him. And then in this one, we actually see the photo of him fighting. So we got the gun and the punch prior. So I'm trying to figure out who does this guy work with? Have we seen this character before? Everybody got a Miri on this season. So he might work for uh, Zion also. Look at Kane's clothes. The shooting with Zion will be episode six. Uh, let me see. What information do we believe that Kane is trying to get from this gentleman here? Because this guy, if you got a Miri on, I don't think you're out here wreaking havoc in the streets. I think if you're wearing a Miri, you're just casually walking down the streets. You know what I mean? You might get, you might get, you know, misidentified, you know what I'm saying? Wrongfully accused of doing something. But if I got a Miri on, I'm not about to be causing no trouble. I would have told this gentleman, hey, Kane, what are you doing, sir? Please don't punch. Shit, what you punch me? Hey, what you got that gun for, man? I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing. I ain't seen nothing. Said Zion's worker. Now we do see Zion. I'll, I'll talk about Zion like briefly. But I want to go into what Kane got going on with his family members. What he got going on. Him and Drew, what they got going on. Well, it ain't going to be much because it looks like Drew's going to be in jail this season. Him and Diana don't really, they already don't have a, a good relationship anyway. <clears throat> Him and Monet is kind of roughy because she's over on Tariq's side a little bit more. So he didn't move on towards Noma to prove that he's really a man and not some mama's boy. So do we believe that this is Cain doing Cain or is this Cain doing Noma's bidding? Like, is Kane actually about to be making moves for himself, or is he going out there because Noma's like, damn, Noma gave it up to Davis. I wonder, does Kane know? Scratch what we talk about. Does Kane know that Noma has a legal obligation to Davis? Or oh, he don't know that yet. I'm trying to think, what would I do if I found out the woman that I was loving was loving someone else? What would I do if the woman I was loving was loving somebody else? Cause that would make me very upset. I think I would be in the streets whooping ass. Think about it. What would you be doing?
Kane doesn't know about the legal obligation. He thinks two plus two is five. Well, in some worlds, two plus two is five. <laughs> Nah, see, it's it's different. It, it's different. If you ain't never been like 21, 22. See, mine was mine was 19 and 31. I was 19 and she was 31. But I was a G though. So I really can't put myself in that type of situation. But normally, if you like around like 21, 22, and you got you a little 40-year-old that got this kind of money. You might go a little crazy. You might do some shit. We looking at you like, hey, bro, you tripping, bro. She old as hell. Even though she ain't really old, just you young. You know what I mean? It'll be one of these moments. Just imagine the girl you loving, she loving somebody else. <laughs> This is this is exactly what you would say. This is what you say if the woman you've been loving is loving someone else. Let me try. I gotta fight every night to prove my love. <laughs> what you gotta do? I gotta fight every night to prove my love. <laughs> I gotta fight every night to prove my love. No, I was a G. I was certified. I was a, I was a, I was a capital G at 19 years old. All right. So Kane is out here wilding out. We're not sure if Kane is doing his own thing, if Kane is doing what Noma wants. But I, I think I think the way Kane is moving right now is because of Noma. And, excuse me. And the reason I say that is because there's a lot of scenes where we see this here. Wait a minute. Is that the jacket he got on? Oh, no. He got on a brown jacket. I think Noma still got a hold over Kane. Plus, I mean, let's be real. The Tejadas ain't got no plug. They ain't got no connect. Kane is using Noma just like he did Effie. When did Kane use Effie? Effie was using Kane the whole time. Demarcus, I think you got the story. See, you a Kane fan, Demarcus. I think you got Kane. I don't remember Kane using Effie ever. Effie's always been the she's been the user. Let me see. What else do we got from Kane? Kane fighting Noma. So this is Tariq. So this isn't Kane. Wait, that's the only time we only time we see Kane. It's with the gun and with Noma. Oh, no, no. We do see Kane in the shoe. Oh, okay. Wait. Here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. So Kane has on the brown right here. Kane has on the. Is that the same? Oh, is it? So, all right. There is a shootout that's going on. And Kane is down in the brown shirt. <laughs> down in the brown. 
Kane got the brown shirt on here while they're doing some shooting. Kane may have got shot at, and then after he got shot at, he went and fought this dude. What up, Brillo? So Kane's getting shot at. I don't know if he's at the bar. It looked like he's at a restaurant. He gets shot at. Once he gets shot at, he gets up, wipes off. He got to go in the streets, and he got to find out who the fuck shot at him. So boom. He goes and fights this dude. And the reason he goes and fights this dude is because maybe, maybe, possibly, this is the shooter. Maybe Kane's in the building because he whooped on Zion. Zion got to get revenge in the streets. Revenge is shooting a nigga. Get your ass whooped by fist. Get a gun. Shoot a nigga. Kane's in here eating. You know what I'm saying? He got his shrimp spaghetti. Mmm. 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 He eating his shrimp pasta. Chowing down. Don't it feel good to see people up on it? Zion pull up. A rude awakening. Now, we thought it was going to be easy like a Sunday morning. Hell no. It's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. It's a fucking shootout. Zion pulls up after getting his ass whooped like, hell no, Kane ain't going down like that. Boom. Now we getting shot at. Kane sees it's Zion. He's like, what the fuck, Zion doing this? This bitch ass nigga, I whooped his ass. I told him that no one was good in the hood. So now instead of going to get at Zion, he goes and gets at this nigga. Boom. Where that bitch ass nigga Zion been? I don't know nothing, Kane. I don't know nothing. And that's why he pulls the gun out. Oh, you gonna know something, nigga. I told you, Kane, man. Come on, baby. It's me, man. I don't know nothing, man. I'm out here starving, Kane. Zion ain't putting us on, man. Man, if I knew it, I'd tell you. Kane like, oh, no, I don't want to hear none of that. And pistol whips the nigga. Bink. Boom. Oh, shit, my bad. I know exactly what that nigga Zion is. Man, he ain't in the warehouse no more. After he whooped his ass, man. I'm going to tell you exactly what he, what he said after you whooped his ass. Man, nigga, fuck Kane, nigga. Man, nigga, fuck Kane, nigga. Man, nigga, Kane, nigga. So now we know who was doing the shooting. So Kane gets changed. Now he got to go and talk to who? Hey, Noma, these niggas ain't playing around in this motherfucking nigga tried to knock my motherfucking noggin off today. Who do you mean they tried to knock your noggin off, Kane? I'm saying... Niggas had the chop chops and they wasn't playing no more. Motherfuckers were trying to split my shit. They were trying to turn my fade into your weed. They were trying to end the game. No more. No more. Like, what do you mean? I thought you said I was good in the hood. I thought you was too, but these niggas ain't playing. I'm going to need one of them chop chops. Matter of fact, you got a rocket launcher because I'm blowing some shit up. And no one's like, Kane, wait a minute. We need to think this through because you told me we were good. We said that the Tahada name hell wait. Whole time she fucking Davis. She got the scent of a lawyer on her and Kane don't even know it because his nose is so wide open for Effie. He's confused. He's a mama's boy. So now Noma's running the game and she's realizing that Kane might actually be a weak link. So she has to reevaluate how she's looking at Kane. Like, I don't know about this nigga. He running a little reckless around here. We might have to put the chop chop on him. So it's going to be hard for Kane in these streets. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, just, I'm just going off of what we've seen. I'm just going off of what we've seen. Now, that's just one theory. Because they, the way they got it chopped up in the, in the trailer is a little bit different. The way it is in the trailer, it is. What do I? So there's the shooting right here with Kane in the trailer, but the way they have it is they got Don Carter and Kamal Tate. But I don't think they're actually. 
I think Don Carter and Tate are after Effie in the Russian building, and we see Effie running up out of there. And this shooting is actually between Zion and Kane. Hey. Okay. Good call, DeMarcus. Way to bring up way to bring up Kane, man. Way to bring up Kane. But you know how I feel it. Man, man, nigga, fuck Kane, nigga. Man, nigga, fuck Kane, nigga. All right, we getting somewhere. Okay. Good shit, y'all. Kane versus Zion. The moment we've been waiting. The moment we've been waiting. I like that. Yeah, I like I can see that happening. That sounds that sounds plausible. Let me go ahead and put that over here for y'all. Oh, I forgot all about uh fucking Janet. All right, bet. Now, what do we, I mean, that kind of tied in Noma right there. We don't know if he knows about uh, fucking Noma and Davis. They didn't show Noma and Davis together in the trailer. All of Davis's scenes were by himself, and there really aren't any more, uh, any more scenes of Kane. So I'll just bring Monet up. What do we think? Is Kane going to get back with the family? Oh, yeah, Kane, I mean, Zion is definitely mad about that fight. That's what I was saying, man. He was like, man, this bitch-ass nigga whooped my ass. Oh, well, I got to go shoot him. <laughs> I got to, ain't no rematch. Let me see what y'all was talking about. Zion pulls a drive by. Miri is the sponsor of this season. Hey, it looked like it, man. Everybody got a Miri on. I'd be on there. They'd be like, Mo, what you want to wear? You want this a Miri? I'm like, hell nah, man. You just got some regular t shirts. You got like some all blacks. Let me get one of them all black t shirts right there. Y'all got some white beaters. I want Hanes. I don't wear the fruity balloon. <laughs> I want some Hanes. Y'all got some Wayne and some Hanes white beaters. Let me get some Hanes white beaters. Let me get a. Uh, Excuse me, let me get a large. Yeah, just give me a pack of 12 of those. I'll be all right. Brillo said Mo was cooking. Hey, Brillo, are you free? Brillo, I dropped the link. Y'all want Brillo to come up or y'all want to want to do a couple more characters and then Brillo come up? We got, we're in, uh, we're at about an hour now. Yeah, we had an hour down. Everybody knows that. Uh, everybody knows Diana's pregnant. Remember, they were sitting at the table. Kane show up and said, "Congratulations." I, oh, I forgot all of. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I forgot all about Diana. Man, they shouldn't have took this break, man. I mean, it's cool because it it hype us back up. Even though we're doing this live, we probably won't talk about power for like the next two weeks, and then. We'll start ramping it back up, but I don't know. Let me see. I'm a I'm a text him. Oh boy. All right. I mean, that's, I mean, I really don't know about the family. 
I can see him getting back with Monet for just for a split second, but then he's gonna just really be lost up in the streets, man. What was the purpose of the break? Uh, I guess they were just trying to space it out because it's the finale. I mean, there was really no reason, but but then again, uh, probably because people are gonna be out for summer break. Think about it. Everyone's traveling during the summer. Uh, well, they did have the last episode during the Fourth of July weekend, but I, I guess. I guess you could say because people are going to be out of the house and, you know, they want to enjoy their weekends during the summer and then bring it back like once school starts back, once people get back into the house.